or I'm in a deep relationship. But you know, relationships for me is something I can live without, but I'm a lot better with it. Well, it's a constantly ongoing process where you need your own time, but you also need to, to develop and deepen the relationship. So it's a constant on and off going process. I'm sort of thinking if I should take some sort of pause right now and, and more watch what will happen if I log out at times and, and more watch than participate actively. Uh, I would say it's complicated because I'm not faithful enough, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> because if there is something new coming up, I'm like, oh, I want to check that out really fast. So, but, I, but I keep my old devices a fairly long time, I guess. So just adding up family growing and that some are dying. Before, the camera was the camera and the mobile phone was a mobile phone. But now my mobile phone is also a camera and a computer. So I think that's the main change. I expect my technology to do more for me. I want them to do everything. I wanted to do shopping lists and I wanted them to, do, to choose things for me and tell me what to do and stuff. So I want them to be a more uh, integrated part of my life. Uh, I would say it's complicated. <laughs> Uh, basically because uh, uh, being raised or born into, into technology uh, isn't always that easy. Uh, well, basically my relation, re relationship to technology has changed very much during the years, uh, trying to combine uh, being used to internet, using the internet and also being a political activist of some kind. Uh, it's not always a, an easy merge to do. I think my, my main problem is that uh, I'm, I like technology, but I'm very bad at using, I, like hacking, coding, or wha whatever. So my main features are basically understanding technology, uh, and I'm trying to understand how to use it more practically. Well, I, I've been uh, hanging around IRC for 15, 20 years, soon, soon to be, uh, since 94, 95, uh, and I got stuck basically. Uh, I can't leave. Um, I have tried lots of times, but uh, haven't succeeded to, to leave the IRC channels, basically. I, I would uh, like to see Windows die, uh, basically, because it's already hurt and, and bleeding. has been bleeding for many years, so it's uh, time to put it out of misery. Uh, we are married, I would say, uh, because we are together all the time. I, I keep my devices with me, at least my iPhone, all the time to work, at subway, at toilet, in bed, whatever. Uh, in fact, uh, one and a half year ago when I broke my ankle joint, I started to use my computer in bed because I couldn't walk. Uh, and. Uh, since then, uh, I always have at least two devices in my bed. <laughs> but there, it was changing after a while. Uh, I, I, I stopped having my computer in bed. But then, uh, three or four months ago, I bought my iPad. And now I have my iPad in bed instead. It's not like I'm doing something actively to, to change it now. I use it for everything. I communicate with all my friends and uh, I, I check in at all the places I am visiting. Yeah, I use it for everything. <laughs> it, it makes my life easier. Really, yeah. <laughs> I didn't even turn my uh, iPhone off when I, when I was at the x-ray, when I broke my ankle joint. <laughs> One word, very close friends. That's one word. <laughs> I want to be a friend with my gadgets. Well, I think I, I'm a person that normally own my own 
own technology actually compared to some others that maybe like outsource so and put things in the cloud so uh, I'm, I'm probably more conservative person well I'm using Facebook absolutely but I also for example for for certain things that I can like mail and chat and other kind of stuff and Jabber I run my own servers I like gadgets but <laughs> in general, I think I'm also a pretty critical person against gadgets because if the gadgets doesn't work, I don't use them. So, and the same thing with services because I, don't, I just don't have time to fight the materia. So to fight service and to, to fight things, like I don't like that. And that might be also one of the reasons why I also run my own things and, own, and I, I want to be in control. And, but on the other hand, I'm also lazy. So if it is possible for me to have other people run the stuff that, 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 but I, that I, can, I can still feel comfortable, that's fine. What we see is not as much change as people might think. I think, for example, that people are, are doing like clouds and other kind of stuff that people talk about. It only has, it's only a question on, on, on where, who is actually owning and who is running various different kind of services that you use. And when in reality, the, the, uh, the actual technology that we're using are not changing much. Remember that the protocol that we're using is HTTP that was invented like in 1993 or like even earlier around 93. And, and what has happened since? Not much, right? We have a new version of HTML. The rest is just implementation using the tools that are not changing. So the fast change is how we use tools that don't change so often. Because of the good implementation of better services, we see that people can use the services of things they didn't use them for before. We can use services on an internet for things that we earlier didn't. And the second thing is because we have the new cool tools people develop, people can change their habits. And we can change the processes in the society, both as humans and enterprises. And that is a very big thing, so change, I think. Because of new cool tools and services, we can change the way we are living, learning, playing and whatever we do. One, one big change is, is of course like that more and more information is digitized and, and that implies that more and more things we do are digitized like payments, uh, documents and, and everything because even though we geeks think that we have been using digital age for like 20 years I think in the society we're not changing until now and there are still a lot of things that are still on paper and must be on paper for legal reasons if nothing else.